In this video, we're going to look at rounding numbers to the nearest whole number. So round 7.4 to the nearest whole number. So here we've got a number line. We've got 7 and we've got 8 and we've got 7.5 in the middle. 7.4 would be somewhere like here on the number line, 7.4. As you can see, 7.4 is closer to 7 than it is to 8. So 7.4 to the nearest whole number would be 7. This time we've been asked around 43.8 to the nearest whole number. So again, we've got 43 and 44. And 43.8 uh, would be somewhere on the number line around this region, 43.8. As you can see, it's closer to 44 than it is to 43. So if it rounded to the nearest whole number, the answer would be 44. Here we've got a number, 123.67. The 1 stands for 100, so this is the 100s column. 2 stands for 20, so it's in the 10s column, 20. We've got 3 in the units column, and then we've got the decimal point. After the decimal point, next comes the tenths column, so we've got 6 tenths. And then after that, you've got the hundredths column. Next would be the thousandth column, and so on. When you're rounding to the nearest whole number, you only need to look at this tenths column. This number here will make it help you decide whether you're going to round up or round down. If this number is 0, 1, 2, 3, or 4, you will round down. If this number, the tenths number, is 5, 6, 7, 8, or 9, you will round the number up to the next whole number. Let's have a look at some questions. So, here are some numbers, 8.9, 14.2, 1.912, 7.49 and 0 0.6182 and we're going to round all of them to the nearest whole number. So we've got 8.9 in the tenths column is a 9. That means we're going to round up. So we're going to go up to the next whole number which would be 9. This time we've got 14.2. In the tenths column is a 2. That means we're going to round down. So we're going to round down to 14. This time we've got 1.912. 1.912. In the tenths column is a 9. That means we're going to round up, so the next whole number would be 2. This time we've got 7.49. In the tenths column is a 4. That means we're going to round down, so we would round down to 7. And finally, 0 0.6182. In the tenths column is a 6. That means we're going to round up, well, the next whole number would be 1. So that's how you round numbers to the nearest whole number.